recently made a tutorial about AI Cat channel which actually got a lot of attention. So I decided to make another video for an AI channel, but this time chicken sad stories. Sounds interesting, right? Actually, I haven't seen any tutorials or channels talking about this niche yet. So you will be the first one to know about this idea. Quite a good deal, right? In this video, I will show you exactly how to make AI chicken shorts but with a little twist. I will teach you something different so that your video will stand out from the crowd. So without further ado, let's get started. Step 1. Generate Storyboard Simply go to ChatGPT, paste this prompt, and hit enter. As always, I will leave Google Docs link in the video description below for you to access all the prompts I use. Feel free to use it for your own purpose. Here's the result. I like it so far. But if you are not satisfied with the result, simply click this Regenerate button and it will give you another option. Now that we got our storyboard, we can now proceed to the next step. Step 2. Generate Visuals I will show you two methods to generate your visuals. In the first method, we will use Leonardo AI. You can click the link in the description to sign up for a free account. Once logged in, choose Image Generation. Next, choose the 3D animation style. After that, adjust the number of images into 4. Then, change the aspect ratio into 9 by 16, since we are making short form content. After that, you can now start entering the prompts we generated earlier. Simply go back to ChatGPT, copy the prompt, paste in the box and hit generate. If you are not satisfied, simply click the generate button again to get another option. Choose the image you like and click this upscale button to enhance the quality of the image. Wait until it's done and download the image. Repeat the process until you finish generating all the images. Here's the second method. We will use another free text to image generator Microsoft Bing. You can click the link in the video description below to sign up for a free account. Once logged in, you will see this interface. Now, simply paste your prompt in this box and add this particular prompt to create consistent images. After that, simply click the Create button to continue and wait until it's done. I also put the additional prompts in the Google Docs link in the video description below, so make sure to check it out to get better results. It may take some time to generate, so be patient. It's not like forever because it doesn't exist at all. What? Once it's finished, simply select the one you like and download it. Do this until you finish generating all the visuals needed for your video. I only show you ideas. Feel free to use your preferred method and AI tools you are comfortable with. You can actually level up your visuals. Just go to Runway ML and choose Gen 2 and upload the images you generated. After that, click this motion brush and start brushing the part you want to animate. Make sure to adjust the sliders to control the motion. It can either be horizontal, vertical, proximity, or the Z-axis and ambient. Just play around with it. You can actually add up to 5 brushes for every image. These brushes help you separate the elements of images and control the movement of them. When you're done, just click the Generate button to continue. Once you're satisfied with the results, just click the Download button. You can do this to all your images if you want. Alright, now that we got our visuals, we can now proceed to the next step. Step 3. Generate Character Go to Adobe Express website and log in your account. You can click the link in the description to sign up for a free account. Once logged in, you will see this interface. Simply click this animate from audio to continue. After that, you will see this interface where you can find hundreds of free to use Adobe characters in different categories. Feel free to choose the one you like. In our case, we will choose the animal category and find something related to chicken. I think this chicky character would be perfect for our video, so I will choose this one. Next, let's change the background to green to make our next step smoother. After that, you can now upload an audio or record your own voice to animate the character. In our case, we will use music since my video doesn't have voiceover at all. To do that, simply click this browse button and upload the music that you like. As you can see, it automatically analyzes the audio and starts animating your character. Wait until it's done and download the result. I also included the link in the description of the background music I used for this video. You can check it out if you want but make sure to attribute or mention the channel to avoid copyright issues. You can use any YouTube MP3 converter to download the audio. Now that we have our character, we can now proceed to the most important part. Step 4. Final Video Editing As always, we will use CapUt for this purpose. Open CapUt, start a new project and upload all the visuals you generated earlier. Next, click this Modify button and adjust the ratio to 9 by 16. Then, start adding all the visuals based on the storyboard that ChatGPT gave us. 
Make sure that the visuals are arranged correctly or else the people will get confused. Next, let's add our character on top of our visuals. After that, click the video and go to cutout and choose the chroma key. Then, use the color picker to get rid of the green background. Adjust the strength and shadow to your preference. In my case, the strength is 6 and the shadow is 38. It may differ from your perspective, so make sure to adjust it properly to get the best results. After that, let's add transitions in between scenes to make it more engaging. You can also add stock footage in between scenes to pass the monetization policy. Then, let's also add effects and animation. After that, go to Filter and find the Clear 2 Filter effect and adjust the slider until it covers the whole video. Finally, hit the Export button to download your final output. Alright, that's it, Hustlers. It's your time to decide and take action as quickly as possible before it gets saturated. Before we watch the final video, can you do me a little favor by clicking that like button and subscribing to my channel? It will really help me a lot in growing this channel. And if you have topics you want us to cover, please comment down below. Finally, let's watch the final video together.